Okay. The moment you've all been waiting for. This is the brand new out of box IBM PS2 Model 80 386. 2 megabytes of memory, 300 megabyte full height Mac Store hard drive, 380 megabytes unformatted, 300 formatted. Well, I just installed DOS 622 and Windows 203. That's right, Windows 2.03. Because I don't have Windows 95 handy, I have to get another copy. So, here we go. Because the built-in clock battery was dead, in fact, this is what it uses. This is a 6-volt camera battery. I had to jury-rig a 6-volt uh, lantern battery in there, and... I use some jumper wires to hook it up. But, uh, once I get back into the town, I'll pick up another battery for it. Look at how fast that thing starts up. Now you navigate Windows 2.03 it's similar to DOS Shell, where you have to actually click on the folder names and open up different uh, directories that way. This is Microsoft's answer to Mac OS, which is kind of scary if you ask me. But, got a calculator. Got reversey. Come on. There we go. I never quite... This is like Othello. I've never understood this game. Anyhow. Got... Windows right. This mouse sucks. There we go. Even. Let's see large font. Uh, can you read that? Yeah. You do get multiple fonts. Of course, it's not Weissy Wig, so you have to kind of guess as to what they are. Let's see, you have Roman, 20 characters per inch. Uh, Whatever. This sucks. Alright, I gotta put some more applications on this, but... Notepad. Just no better than Windows Write. And I believe there's a Paint application, too. Where is it? There it is. Paint.exe. this do? Not really sure. Oh, spray paint. Pencil, free line draw. Ooh, nice. This is a 3D thingy. Not really sure how that works. Uh, what else do we have here? I just installed an application that I found on discs. It's a cross-reference guide for Thompson Consumer Electronics. Where is that? SK Cross. Let's see how that runs. I'm not really sure which one it is. Here. Cancel. I guess Windows doesn't let you run anything. Eh. Nice. Now this is not Windows 386, which is enhanced for the 386 processor. I think. Oh wait, maybe it is. Nice. 
If you look on YouTube, there's a video of Windows 3D6. It's an internal advertisement, or uh, one that they, Microsoft has sent out to their clients for Windows 3D6. It dates back to around 1987. I believe, let's see, this is from 1987. Um, 298 kilobytes free. Yikes. This is, a, okay, it's not acknowledging all two megs. That's not good. Um, hmm. Oh, we got a clock too. See? Nice clock. Uh, built in calendar. This is the great great granddaddy of Windows Vista. And if I do say so myself, there aren't many improvements. Let's go ahead and close out of Windows. I'm going to try to launch that. Uh, let's see. And. Looks like we're going to run GLXE. I haven't actually played with this. Greased Lightning. Okay, that's really not what I thought it was. DIR. 1000 TCE. There it is. Press Escape to continue. Oh, you suck. I found this in a pile of discs that I had, and uh, I wasn't really sure what it was all about, but... Hmm. 1000 TCE. Semiconductor cross-reference directory. Press escape to continue. And it brings you to a... Hmm. That sucks. Well, you get the idea. Alright. Windows. Win. There we go. Haha. <laughs> Works every time. Now, there's no control panel. Oh, yeah, there is. There it is. <laughs> this is the advanced control panel of Windows 2.03. You can set your time, your cursor blink rate, your double click speed, printers, okay. Uh, add printer, add new font, delete font, screen colors. Oh, you can change the colors. I didn't know that. I'm going to change the background. Um, you, it's all grainy. I think I want it to be red. But this is before the features of adding um, different backgrounds. Uh, you know, you couldn't really do a whole lot with this. So I just changed my background color to red. Look at this disc icon. <laughs> Five and a quarter inch disc. This is it, man. This is Windows 2.03 in all its glory. Unbelievable. I haven't used this in years. The last time I used this was on an airplane um, on a trip to Disney World. I set up an old Hyundai laptop with Windows 2.03 and all my favorite games and I use that as my entertainment. The battery held up from New Hampshire until about Maryland and then the battery died. But that was the last time I ever used Windows 2.03. Now Windows 1.1 is almost identical to this with minor changes and less reliable if you can imagine. Windows 1.1 or 1.0 was available for download at one point just like this one. 
Um, but it, it actually had some files missing, so I could never get it to run. Windows 2.3, um, I downloaded about 10 years ago. It's 1999 is when I got it, and uh, well, it's been a few years. I haven't seen it online since. And I'm still waiting to get a copy of Windows 3.1, which is my favorite version of the earlier Windows releases. Um, because it seems to work pretty well. Well, until then, let's go ahead and shut her down. <laughs>